stuff and big up their chest and that's all you guys get from this you know when you at least go out there and win everybody a post a post and a run and I say yeah man yeah man we big we are big we look about we talawa look about we talawa and bad mind too bad mind and ungrateful that's what that's what that's what I see I see the whole thing as you know what I mean you guys just get a kick out of, out of all of this but then when they at least don't perform well everything change what's up viewers welcome back to the channel today i'll be sharing a video from asafa powell and he's sharing his opinion on some of the athletes being criticized for not performing at this year world championships before we get into the full video do me a huge favor by liking this video also if you're new to this channel please consider subscribing that way you'll be fully updated this track and piece season jamaican sprinter and former world record holder in the 100 meter asafa powell took to his youtube page to basically speak on the athlete's behalf based on his personal experience and what we're seeing happening, is, happening now is that our athletes or some of our athletes rather are being heavily criticized Johan Blake for one he's been criticized for not performing to expect expectation at the world championships Elaine is in it as well Shelly and Fraser Price is being criticized for her behavior we see where Kemba Nelson um, undergo a heavy criticism on Twitter so that she had to delete her Twitter account and the list goes on now we have Asafa Paul basically speaking on behalf of the athletes and basically speaking from a personal point of view because he once had to experience what they're experiencing now and he definitely made some solid points in this video so I'm going to share it with y'all and you can definitely let me know your thoughts and opinion on this one in the comment section before you go as well you can leave a like on this video also if you haven't subscribed as yet you can do that that way you'll be fully updated this track and fee season we're always always going we get one month break one month to rest and that's it you know so there it does a lot a lot on the body um you one got injured 2000 i went 13 got injured 2013 and 2011 you won the World Championships was second in the 200 behind you, um, you see. And 2012, the same thing, he, he got second in the 100 meter and second in the 200 meter. And that same year, he ran 9.69. And the whole of Jamaica, blah, 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 blah. one bag of, one bag of something. When, when, when he won the, he won the, he won both. The 100 and the 200 at the national trials, and when when he win the thing at the national trials, all of the wagoners start jump and you and ban wagon. Everybody start why him beat both him this and that. What? Everybody start jump on the ban wagon. That go just goes to show you how Jamaican people are. You know them. Anything new. Them run gone. That's why the, the that's why restaurants and clubs and all them sitting they can't survive out here because the minute something new come, them gone. It's the same thing with music and musicians. The minute somebody new come on, then those figures say everybody is old or old news and all that stuff. So it's just it's, it's just one of them things where just have a shake it sometimes. Because in the idea, the athletes are out there, they're working for themselves. They're not working for Jamaica. Because Jamaica don't pay people. So, they're not working for Jamaica, they're working for themselves. When they leave the championship, it, our, our life, our career is not one week. You know, where the world championship, you know, it goes on for a week or Olympic. Our career is not one week, it don't last one week. After we done compete, we have to come back home to light bill, water bill, food bill family all of them something and shake and that's how we come home to you know what i mean so at the end of the day we're not doing it we're not doing it you know we're representing jamaica yes but we're not really we're, we're doing it for ourselves because we have to live we have to live so we're not allowing to kick up and go on and say oh this i'm gonna have to retire this i'm gonna have to do something retire for what why it's a job our job this is our job. Why why we should retire for you? Who are you? Eleven months of the year we train and I can bet say no none of you guys who talking. None of you who talking would get up out of your bed for one world just one month. Just come watch. Just come sit down and watch and support the athletes them. Just get up out of your bed, go find where the athlete them train and just cheer them on. Just say, yeah man, you can do it. 
you know, you know, but not care. You just, you just see, you just see one entire week of people life and this figure say, oh yeah man, if you don't know man, in career done.